Alright, sorry about that, people. My camera up here, like, my camera said I had 30 minutes at least left of recording, and then it suddenly said my card was full. Okay, yeah, right. Anyways, oh, there's the key. Alright, we're gonna drop this in here. Drop it when it's hot, because it is probably hot. This is the mine. Anyways, people, I am running out of space on my card, my SD card. I'm looking to get another one soon, which would be nice, because I could upload tons of videos. Usually, I just I don't know why I'm. I honestly don't know why I'm on it. Wait. Oh, I know why now. Because my recording is set to uh, T5 instead of just normal. Great. I love this. I made a mistake. I made a mistake, guys. I set my recording resolution to TV fine and that's not what I wanted. TV normal is what I usually use so I can upload a lot faster. A lot more and a lot faster. That's what I use for my Paper Mario videos at least. Anyways, yeah, now it's set to TV fine. TV fine isn't even that different. I just learned that it takes longer to upload. This is a YouTube friendly thing, and I haven't uploaded a TV super, uh, TV fine thing yet. Well, I have, but my, it was on my friend's account. Anyways, thing is, it takes a while for it to upload. Anyways. Yeah, this place also... Nah, I wouldn't say this place gets hard. This place is rather easy still, no matter what. There are some things that trick you, though. Like the orc mages, some of them are thunder, fire, or blizzard specific. This was a bad idea. When all else fails, since you're a Loki, you can just beat the crap out of everything. Anyways. It's always nice to have. I hate Cycle 1, it's so not filled with treasure. Anyways, this is the boss dome area thing. Anyways, this guy's also this guy's probably the hardest guy as of yet. It's probably gonna be the hardest guy you're gonna face for a while now. Because he likes to switch up his tactics on you. If you're a little P when, he's, when he goes far away from you and uses fire magic, then just use the focus attack you got from the novice weapon. Ow. Or just use it in general. Oh, 
that's annoying. The orcs get easy to kill. Either A, want to beat the living crap out of him before he gets done. But if you don't think you can make it, then run to the corner. Run to A, run to an opposite corner of him, and defend. Ayuk can completely defend against it. Like, he won't take any damage whatsoever. Your other characters, however, will take quite a bit of damage even when they're defending. So make sure you cure that. Make sure you cure yourself. Anyways, this is the last video for today. One because I'm tired of this game already. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm lying. But mostly because my SD card decided to be full and go down two seconds at a time, so one second. Anyways. are stupid. Oh, you want to hear the weird thing? The first time I played this game ever, I named my character Koopo. And they said Koopo, and I was like, whoa. <laughs> I'll send I don't know what to send and some bronze. They're all very indifferent about me. Oh, here we go. What? You'll find that your diary is very not filled.
I won my way through the vivid green hills and followed the path to reach the river bell. All my attention seemed to flow away with the riverbell's serene currents. As I pressed onward, I slew many goblins. I soon saw a rainbow over a great waterfall. I could have known that I would fight the giant crab surrounded by such beauty. I came across the caravan from Alphataria today. The town was already buzzed with talk of the Black Knight. But Sol had more tales to tell. Sol spoke with such enthusiasm that he actually seemed to admire him. It is astonishing how quickly word of the Black Knight has spread in spite of the way Miasma isolates every town. The Miasma Stream. Many caravans have passed through, and now I will follow in their tracks. Someday, others will follow me. I feel like I have become a small part of history. As I approach the mushroom forest, I somehow feel like I'm shrinking. Each toadstool I pass seems taller than the last. Now I know I am inside the forest. I'm walking along the rooftop of mushrooms. Although a Malbora blocked my path, I prevailed and collected a drop of myrrh. I ran across the caravan from Liuda. Those two Selkies are some characters. They seem to be enjoying the journey more than observing their duty. It was a refreshing outlook, but it worried me. I began to understand how Soul of Alphataria must have felt about me. Mars Pass. This land was once home, once the home of the Wolf Thieves. With the iron weapons they wrought here, they had once ruled the entire world. Now this place is but a small town at the crossroads. Time washes away everything. Joy, agony, everything. The mine of Cathurgis is a relic of the Age of Lotion Rain. Orcs rule it now. As I venture deep into the mine, I kept jumping at my own shadow, cast on the walls by the flickering lamps overhead. I found the Orc King waiting for me in the deepest cavern within. After my victory, I collected a drop of myrrh. And that's it! With my first journey behind me, my caravan has finally come home. Before settling out, I had heard only stories of the world outside. Once out there, I found excitement, surprise, and a bit of hardship. Whenever I close my eyes, I vividly remember all my adventures as I search for Myrrh. Tonight is the festival. It's time to celebrate.